in this video we'll compare the patch that just appeared with the previous patch we'll uh, see how it works without fsr and then at the end we'll also check how it works with an overclock steam deck when i recorded this video the re framework mode didn't work but usually they do not take too long until they are fixing it so yeah in a matter of days it will work again uh, first of all we'll see a side-by-side -side comparison between this patch and the old patch and yeah we are going to use uh, the low preset uh, the textures will be mostly on high but without too much VRAM associated with them and we are going to leave most of the post-processing effects on those are not really that demanding and it makes the game look quite nice i would say we also have a test later on where we put everything on low and we do not use fsr but we are going to force the resolution to the lowest possible from the steam properties page and i think that helps a bit with the performance even though the native or the actual resolution is quite the same as the one used when using fsr because uh, the fsr algorithm is not executed anymore then the cpu is a bit freed up and it actually increases the performance fortunately it doesn't look that great so yeah that's a downside but yeah you will see that uh, after this test in the patch release notes they promised they will continue to add performance improvements in future patches and from what i've read this patch actually has just one performance improvement it's related to scenes where there are a lot of characters it seems that they increased a bit the performance in cpu limited situations from my testing and you will actually see it the increase is not that big actually it's one or two fps actually when you have 20 fps one or two fps is quite a lot but still i expected a bit more let's say but hopefully in the future they will increase it so they have two problems with the performance one is the cpu uh, it is allocated too much for every character and another problem is that the rendering is inefficient because they are actually rendering more than what we see on the screen which is not great and yeah they should definitely improve that Do your injuries pain you? Pray, do not overexert yourself. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis hard. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. Let's make ready for the morrow. All up on it. My exam. I smoked up for a moment. Time for you to get to work. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. is quite cluttered. Pray leap over all that post. Oh, this worrying's giving me an aching back. A job well done. 
Now the next step is to... What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to investigate. can see a bit of an improvement in this fight scene, not much, but actually while playing this it felt a bit smoother, so that's good, I would say. The biggest improvement I saw was in the first settlement, where the frame rate would go down to maybe 13, 14 FPS before, and now, yeah, it didn't go that low, so again, a good improvement there. Boulders, barrels, and the like can make effective weapons that will never come back to you. Delivering targeted strikes, I would recommend you. performance in the cinematics is mostly the same maybe one fps more that accounts to maybe three or four percent more in this place forever you have lost your memories it is surely the work of a foul curse but worry not you need only believe in your own destiny I can't suck it. The accursed creature escaped. Oh, you! Get back here! Ah, quickly! This way or is it? Come this way. Let us flee. Survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. Don't just stand there. Shoot it down.
there are also some situations where it seems that the performance is a bit lower than with the previous patch but I think that's basically the margin of error so we should not take that into consideration all in all the performance is a bit more but yeah I expect it to be more than this Keep your distance, or is it? Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a rift stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you all right? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from, anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly not like that here in Burma. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Natal? Nay, I suppose that's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Vermont being sent. Fine! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir! You'll be needing it! <laughs> I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. If you find your strength lacking, then buy the curative or hammer the decree. When one of the fiends comes, best guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. There are off.
Have you beheld the dragon? I'm not. All I know for sure is that he's a beast, a pair more fierce than a kid. One need only be the fittest of his day. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns? They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? So this being the first settlement, we can actually see some improvements even in the cutscenes. And then we will also see in the gameplay section. Before you stands a rift stone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. It's funny that we can see the biggest improvement in the character creation tool and this being a tool where the GPU is not fully utilized we can actually see that they increased a bit the performance of the CPU. Pawns are known as crossers of the rift, for we are able to connect to and traverse other realms beyond this one. When we return, it is our duty to use our experience from this day forth. I shall serve you as your loyal pawn, and ought I learn... Well, I'll be. You truly are the Arisen, then. Surely there's only meant to be one. The Watchhead would know what to do. I suppose we'll save any further questions. What? Mayhap you could make for me. The Arisen is said to... This is another section where we can see the performance improvement here. Going from 15 to 17 or from 14 to 16. So yeah, a nice improvement. Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask all very well. May... I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. It will be an honor to serve by your side. It is a pleasure to meet you. If ever you've need of an ear to... Hoi there! My pa always used to die. Being armed is better. You should stop by the inn in Melv. If you get the chance. No way. We must rest. Though the sun is still up.
I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. We must not let down our guard. It's quite hard to compare side by side a dynamic gameplay so yeah here you will see that the performance seems lower with the new patch but actually it's just the way the camera is pointed at We have a choice of where to go, but how to know the path best traveled? Let us trust in ourselves and proceed with caution. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. So this is Mel. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. Pity for the reason. That is most unfortunate, but it doth not release thee from thy fate.
Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. Thank goodness. How are you feeling? This is the second time I've watched over you like this. Isn't you do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the arisen. And does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated, though I feared. Has he come for you? We are to part so soon then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then, take care. Marison. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescent. If you claim the same, I dispatched a missive. Would you be willing to accompany? Oh, but I would not depart. Come to think of it, mayhap now would be another settlement where we can see that the performance is increased. So here we see a lot of characters, and we have one or two FPS more. Oh no, I'm an apothecary. So when I have, but, well, it will be a shame to return. What? You did suppose there's no... Seems my luck's not a... We could make the fruit fraudulent ourselves, or simply purchase some. If you really want to have a better performance, then you need to disable FSR and either go with a forced resolution. You can do this from the properties page or you can actually just disable FSR and uh, reduce the image quality slider to the minimum that actually is the rendering resolution
Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? Pawns? They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. Before you stands a Riftstone. It is a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. That is most unfortunate. But it doth not release thee from thy fate. The OLED version overclocks quite nicely, so I can go as low as possible with the CPU, GPU and SOC offset and I can actually increase the GPU to 2000 MHz and the CPU to 3900 MHz but yeah, that doesn't seem to stick because there are a couple of bugs in the tool that I'm using to actually increase my TDP so Actually, the only uh, overclock is the increased TDP and the GPU. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so only uh, overclock if you are really sure 
about what you are doing because you can see now that once we overclock everything is increased the fan noise will increase and also the temperature will increase by around 10 degrees so that's quite a lot i would say and the battery life is reduced to, to one hour and 40 minutes which is quite small still you get a very nice performance and this actually makes the game almost playable so in theory you could play the game like this and be able to finish it without too much problems but yeah it will still go below 30 fps in a lot of sections you but fell that fiend even at the cost of your lives You! Get back here! Ah, quickly! This way, Arisen! Come this way. Let us flee. survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn.
Great. Keep your distance, Arisa. Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a Rift Stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you alright? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment, and was it you then? What is a wonder you survive? Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from, anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly not like that here in Vermont. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Matar? That's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Vermont being sent there. Fine! Gob- If you find your strength flat, buy the curator or have a bit of green one. <laughs> when one of the fiends comes in, best guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. Employ guarded attacks.